Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Jack in, please. Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. Not a customer. Well, all the more reason to be excited. There's a first time for everyone at Clouds. It's no reason to dawdle. All you need to do is jack in. We'll create your personal profile and you'll be good to go. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky think an angel looks good i couldn't have chosen better myself now for the payment and you'll venture into the clouds There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Angel awaits you in booth six. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Clouds Sad. is one of the safest places in all of Night City.
won't find any use for weapons inside. Clouds is one of the safest places in all of the world. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. Let's take a look, shall we? Blood. Fresh, not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. better here. I will eat those thighs. What do you mean, real? She's all ones and zeros. Do you mean I can ask her to do anything? Can I do anything? Yeah. It's not about asking. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here. Now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir.
Let's take a look, shall we? Blood. Fresh, not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. motherfucking week you're not authorized to access the vip area oh yes i am no sir you're not you can take it up with the manager no dog i'm taking it up with you here now you got any idea who i am is there a problem this conk don't understand that i've got a right to be in there from what i can see your vip membership has been revoked say what now Please stay calm, sir, or we're going to have to escort you outside. Oh, no shortage of wise asses. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. Need to piss first. Uh. At least I would hear no laments about pain. Busy day, huh? Here, take a load off. I think I've got just the thing to help you relax. It's V. Just V. Only people I know real well get to use my real name. But we'll get to know each other well in no time, honey. Sure, why not? Do what you do best. I know that you're dying. I'm looking for someone who worked here. Evelyn Parker. Know her? Know where she is? You must see the big picture. You focus too much on details, minor ones, like Evelyn. Please don't act like you know me. I just want some answers. But are you asking the right questions? 
How can you change what has already happened? What do you mean, happened? You know something I don't? What happened to you? What you keep inside and never reveal to anyone. And that is? Come now. You know. Snuffed it once, and I'm gonna have to do it all over again. Got no idea how to stop it. There. Happy. You wish to leave something behind, a piece of yourself. That's why this all began. You wish to be remembered. Yeah. Wanted to reach the top. Be someone. Still do. But seems like that might not happen anymore. Still. If I gotta die, I wanna go down in history. Fuck it, even a footnote would do. And after that? Do you think death is a disappearing act followed by exactly nothing? People I've lost live on in my thoughts, and that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just some stranger's voice in my own body. Yapping away. Mm, no longer part of the world. You will still have an impact there. So you believe death is not the end after all. Reassuring. I think I might just be afraid. So I imagined these things to distract myself from the thought of the void. If what I saw before is any indication, I... You are sensitive. That does not make you weak. Try to suppress your emotions, and you'll drown. So, where do we go from here? This is the part where I tell you what you must do. Oh, uh, okay. Be my guest. You've never backed down from anything, so don't stop now. Not one step backwards. In this city, people die on their way to the corner store for a scop pop. But that threat's never stopped you. You dive into the middle of it all. Always have. Things are moving way too fast. Around me. Without me. I... I can't keep up. A minor delusion. The truth is, we and our paths are braided. Never ending, ever transforming, not being, but becoming. And what's happening inside you, it could change the world. Listen, V, never look back. If you must kill, kill. If you must burn all the world to the ground, then let it burn, okay? Thanks for this. I... I don't want to go out there. No one ever does. But eventually, we all must. Afterlife. What... what happened? You interrupted the session? Did I do something wrong? W were you not satisfied? Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Wait just a sec. That's not how this works. You can't ask me about the dollhouse or anything like that. I could get in serious trouble. Go. Please, just go. I need this info. Name your price. She's not here, and I barely even knew her. That's all I can say. It'll be worth your while. Try to remember. We're not supposed to accept anything from clients. Everything goes through the shift bosses. I, I can't just... Nobody came looking for her. Nothing out of the ordinary happened? 
There was an incident with a client. I don't know the specifics. One doesn't ask about these things around here. Tom might know. He and Evelyn were close. Go ask him. And please leave me alone. Tom, who's he? Friend of Evelyn's. Wasn't a free moment they weren't together. Where'll I find him? He's a doll here. Works the VIP area, booth two. Thanks. Sheesh. Don't ask for me again. Ever. VIP customers only. Better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh, don't have your details. Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. You sure, your VIP card. Need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Mean to say she's not here. She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Osaka or Oslo? Which was it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but everybody calls him Woodman. Never really know why. Okay, Mr. Forrest, then. what's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing.
Left her purse. Could have had more than one. All her shit's in it, though. Must have left in a hurry. Or as you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. Look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho bitch who's never been ghosted by her bill or bow before. But go on. I'm listening. You've got info, I've got eddies. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddies will buy you whores here, not snitches. I look like either of those to you. Told you what you looked like. Don't tell me you weren't listening. Surely a reasonable man like yourself wouldn't mistake a donation for a bribe. Real pleasure chatting. But just where exactly do you see this going? Look, 
We can settle this without anyone getting hurt. Why make this any harder than it needs to be? You should ask yourself that. Listen carefully. One way or another, I'm gonna find her. And when I do, all kinds of shit is gonna happen. Shit you don't want to end up on the wrong side of. Assume you believe your side to be the right one. Take a wild guess. All right, fine. I'll lay it on you straight. Girl you're looking for, Parker? Jane here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their job's to generate profit. Talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, said he knew something or other. The Ripper. Name and address. Don't know her last name. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. Quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co-ed's wet dream. A pleasant day to you. The next time you have that urge for clouds, don't wait. <laughs> 